to show you something. I just saw a person post. They have this question on Facebook. This happened to me. It's kind of painful, but let me just show you. So you want to set up a domain name and you don't want this to go to like, uh, you know, my domain. Oh, let's see if I can move this over. You don't want this to go to like home, right? Because this is the, the page when you set this up. So let me just show you a couple things real quick. Um, what you do is you go to settings. And then over here where it says add edit domains, we're going to open that in a new tab, but you're going to go over there to that. Let's see what that domain is. So that's demo2.ghlidx.com. This, this is where you have to get to. Hit edit. And you set the default page. So there's, you know, you can set it from any of this. This page was originally called home. So I set that. And save it and that's done you may have to check it on a new browser but it's super easy and it's going to save you a ton of grief getting this set up so let me just show you let's see what if these guys are all set up here so let's go uh, demo 3.ghlidx okay that one's not even working so let's go back to our demos I'll show you this from scratch. Uh, right here. Let's go back to our websites. And let's say we're doing uh, this website. Let's click that. And say I want to preview that. Okay, well, that's not what we're looking for. There you go, settings. Okay, you can see it's home and it's it's set as home, right? So let's try to, to hook this up. So settings, let's select a domain. We're going to do demo three. And you can see the path there is this Cancun test, whatever, Freddy. And so that's kind of a mess, right? That's not really what you want to do. But let's save this. And now let's go back in here. Settings, it's still that. So... Let's try that demo three again and see if it'll load now. Might redirect us over to that. No, not loading. So let's go to edit, edit domains, demo three, edit. The default page is the Cancun Test Freddy. And, uh, you know, you can also set whatever you want your 404 page to be and any robots.txt code you have. So we're using this for our real estate stuff. You can use it on obviously anything in high level, but this is fantastic. Check it out. So let's save this. And look at that. There's the demo site. So uh, that's it. Take a look.